What is the glycemic index? The glycemic index is a rating system for foods where any type of carbohydrate has a numerical value assigned to it based on its components and how each food affects the body's sugar levels. Dr. David Jenkins, a Canadian professor and scientist from the University of Toronto, developed the concept of a rating index in March of 1981. He felt that a better system needed to be developed due to the popularity of certain diets like Atkins and South Beach that vilified all carbohydrates and many fats. He wanted to show that it was too oversimplified to categorise carbohydrates as simple and complex, or even worse, as good carbs and bad carbs. Most carbohydrates are too complex to label them in this manner. He wanted to show the scientific community and thereby the world that all foods affect our body's blood sugar levels differently and that they have many different degrees of being simple and complex, good or bad. Basically, as food breaks down in our digestive system, many of the food's components like sugar or vitamins and minerals are absorbed into our bloodstream and immediately affect our system. Foods that break down quickly and have high glucose or sugar levels will give us a spiked feeling of energy and euphoria. This feeling is commonly referred to as a sugar high. Other foods break down more slowly and release their sugars, starches and nutrients over a longer period of time which avoids any sudden increases in our sugar levels and keeps our insulin levels low. Dr. Jenkins proved that many carbohydrates were in fact very healthy and should not be avoided simply because of the fact that they were carbohydrates. As a matter of fact he discovered that there are dozens of foods that in the past were categorized as unhealthy but that turned out to be very beneficial. He also encountered some surprising results on foods that had always been considered diet foods. But when tested, he discovered that they tested very high on the glycemic index. Dr. Jenkins continues to work in the field of dietary science and pushes forward by continually pursuing the link between diet and health. He proceeds in proving the theory that eating certain diets can improve or eliminate the risk of health issues such as cancer, diabetes and cardiovascular disease as well as other diseases.